Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Trofinet, the babbling Belgian, and this is The Last of Us Part 2. Last time, we finally brought the fight to the WLF, the Washington Liberation Front, themselves. And you can kind of see the result of that in the bottom left corner at the moment. There's a woman missing her lower jaw and her lower body as well. Yeah, Ali doesn't fuck around. <laughs> we kind of... Uh, Kind of messed these people up. But last time... Oh, God, there's another bottom half. Wait a second. I only used one bomb. Ah, there we go. The legs are over there. Fine, fair enough. This is a gruesome game, isn't it? But last time we checked out this uh, gas station. But the only thing we didn't check out was the workbench over here. So I think I checked everything else out. There it is. The workbench. So we did gather a lot of materials uh, in the meantime, so I think... So there is a damage upgrade for the bolt action rifle. I'm definitely gonna grab that so we can kill... Hmm... Yeah, replace the barrel to fire more powerful shots, 25% more damage. So we can kill targets in one go if we get to snipe it off. And I'm guessing you might also be able to... I don't know if a silencer also works on the uh, long rifle. The bolt action rifle. So there we go, a fancy new barrel with a different muzzle at the end. There we go. And then we could maybe, can we do something else? We've done all of that. We could increase the fire rate of the revolver. I don't think that's really necessary. So let's just close that off. And we can move along. So it's really weird to actually play this game while the feedback is rolling in from uh, both critics and normal players. Because, um, yeah, the, the, the game has sold immensely. I think it's sold over 4 million at the moment. But on the other hand, there's a lot of negative feedback from mostly, I think, bigoted people uh, surrounding the relationship between Ellie and um, Dina. Which is really, really sad. But also some, some nuanced feedback, like the game is too long for being a game, um, a, a normal, well, this type of game. So an action-oriented adventure, story-driven game that it is uh, a bit too long. And feedback like that got some negative feedback from, uh, from the developers themselves or people working on the game, which is also really sad because I feel like Feedback like that didn't warrant the response that aggressive either. So yeah, it's coming from both sides. And there's even a rainbow. That was very fitting to my uh, my feedback just now. But uh, until now, I really, I really enjoyed the game. Um, the gameplay is similar to what we had in previous games. Are there enemies around? Oh yeah, there are. Um, and it sounds like infected. Oh God, why? There were just soldiers outside. This doesn't make any sense. Is this in the same area? But yeah, I really, I really like the game. The gameplay is very similar. I don't think there has been a lot of change in the gameplay itself, aside from the fact that she, that Ellie can climb and jump a lot more than uh, Joel ever could. But other than that, there's been a few enhancements. There's definitely been improvements of the the gameplay, but it hasn't really changed fundamentally. We're still doing the same things. So there's definitely a clicker on the other side of that door. This still seems to be available, and there's a letter here. Um, Fran, it's happening. Early Sunday morning, keep, you, keep your people off the streets. But be careful what you say. If Isaac finds out I talked, I'm fucked. Whole thing should be quick. Not a lot of federal left in your neighborhood. As we clear neighborhoods, we're moving everyone to the base. People shouldn't freak. It's temporary. Helps us keep track of good guys versus bad guys. Can't wait to sleep in the same bed with you again. No more sneaking notes in that stupid studio. Rebecca. So there we go. Fran is probably also a woman, again, a lesbian relationship, which uh, I usually don't put a lot of emphasis on because it's just normal people being in a relationship. So there's not some, it's not something that should be pointed out. But uh, seeing the feedback this game has gotten, a lot of people are definitely very biased against stuff like that. And I don't want to, I don't want to see that anymore. I can open that up for a little bit more health, but... 
I think they're moving in the other direction now. Oh god. There we go. Let's move that out of the way. So they're trying to detect me. I should, should have probably detected the door opening up. Oh, can they open doors? I don't know if they can open doors. I think they can, but... Might be that clickers don't. So that's... He's turning around again. There we go. Stab the clicker. I think there's literally one on the sides and on the front there. So we get a bit of rags out of that. And there we go. And we can grab her as well. Stab. So uh, it's really weird sometimes runners when they're not um, activated, I should say, or, or in enticed. Did she actually kill the other one? Oh, that's nice. They just look down and they can be approached like you would approach clickers. Because they don't see anything. I think that's about it. And we do get some nice resources here. Because I got a complete rag out of that. And that's already half a bottle. A bottle of alcohol. So I think, yeah, Dina is also standing up straight. So we can open up all the doors. And there must be some more resources around. So yeah, again, gameplay hasn't really changed all that much. Um, definitely because, you know, there's a lot of... Things that have been smoothed out, I do agree with that. We can go prone now, that's also something with the grass, that's a little bit different. But it's just improvements on the existing gameplay. And there's nothing wrong with that, you never change a winning team. But um, I think the only thing that also changed was the fact that the shivs are now removed. Which is also a good thing, I felt like having to be using resources to do stealth kills would have, was a bit annoying either way. I'm actually wondering if I can actually just punch the shot. Yeah, I can punch this. I don't know if that actually used the charge on the pipe. I don't think it did. But that was a little bit more health. These WLF guys went up against the military over a decade ago. Why are they still so amped? There can't be that many trespassers that come through here. I don't know. The city still looks like it's filled with supplies. I can't see why people would need to fight over it. Yeah, good point. There are What's still supplies. See what you can find around here. Okay, Adina just noted what's with all the rainbows, but apparently... Wait, normally when she gets... Wait, wait, wait. The map can be found in your collectibles, but why didn't you... I mean, I could have just checked the map before and not, not anymore. Map of Seattle? Did that change now all of a sudden? Oh, no. Okay, so it's been... A bit updated but it's not as detailed as so I only got a map for downtown before and I feel like I might have missed a few areas there anyway um, but usually she marks an area off the map if you're done with it yeah it doesn't seem like I missed anything in the bookstore uh, otherwise it might be a bit more hidden than I think it is although there is this uh, ladder over here but I think that's just part of the scenery right because they use these kind of ladders that are on a rail and then you can get to the books on the higher uh, shelves, which is fine. Okay, since Dina doesn't note the uh, the rainbows again, I think I might have missed that interaction there. This is the... I think we've been here, right? Although there is something on the floor there. Is that a rifle? No, it's a piece of wood. And that just has tree swings in it. But I can probably improve my... Uh, my current melee weapon with scissors, because I don't think there are scissors on top of it right now. So if I just hit something once more, then I should be able to actually do something else with it. Just improve it again and then go from there. But is that a building I can actually enter? Or is this... No, it's boarded off. Okay, I saw shattered windows. Thought maybe, okay, we can go in. No, we can't. Okay, so we've been... Through most of the areas. This is a big game. Is every single area I want to just scrounge around and take out any other thing we come across? But uh, I think we should probably hurry along a little bit. Because otherwise this uh, playthrough isn't moving, is it? Um, although this seems to move to a corner that we can't do anything with. So there's a military truck here, but that's about it. 
can really go... We can't go through here, right? Because it looks like there's an area behind it. That... Get in there. Let's look around. So, Seattle Military Zone. Maybe through one of the buildings? Maybe I should, shouldn't just be here, because this doesn't seem like I can actually go over. So, maybe around the building? Okay, so this seems to widen up again. But usually that means that there might be enemies around. So, let's just drop down. And be careful about this. Are we going to see more enemies? Careful. Yeah. To the right. I still don't understand why the fuck we're falling back. We're not falling back. We're getting called up. It took us months to secure this zone. Higher ups know what they're doing. Probably. So there's two over there, but I saw someone on the left there as well. Rifle above us. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, so he's inside of the building. So if I can get. Yeah, they're not looking in my direction, are they? I can't actually get into this building. Like this. Ooh, this is... This is pretty big. So if I can find the stairs... Which... Ooh! Okay, okay, I just saw... I just saw what's coming. Um... 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 This is gonna be problematic. I always mess up resetting them though. You better just go. I'm not doing your fucking job, dude. Go check the fucking traps. <gasps> right here! That's that. Oh wow, he just shot me out of cover. Chris! Okay, Dina just got a shot in on him. I should probably. Oh god, that was not a good idea. Uh, that goes. I think I'm gonna get shot here. Right? Okay, that's Dina shooting. Oh, get, no, got shot in the back. I forgot that that guy was there. Ooh, no. Okay, so those two guys were coming down the stairs. So it's probably best to clear out the thing on the right first. Oh no. Oh no, that is a bad checkpoint. Oh, there's one on the other side as well. Okay, so if I climb. I see them! Here, here! No. Okay, I'm gonna die again. <laughs> um, yeah, can we just... Nope. Okay. You know what? Just, just die. Just die. I'm gonna die. Hi. Hi. Ah, and I got spawned immediately. So those two are down. Ooh, shit. Ow. So I'm gonna try and move around the building a little bit. Wait, did I get... Are you fucking serious? There we go. It's okay, so there's one coming down Nothing here. There we go. There we go. Stab her. You doing? Oh shit. This killed Maggie. There we go. Let's grab her and then stab. We're out of sight of anybody else. Okay, so that actually does work. Now, where's the rest? The rest trying to get up. Not for now, it seems. I think they lost track of us just a little bit. Just trying to scrounge as much as I can, because I just spent a whole bunch of my bullets again. Uh, and I'm out of bottle as well, so definitely need to look around. Okay, so that's scissors. The baseball bat is nice, but I'm going to be able to strengthen my pipe in a second as well. There was something over here as well. That's alcohol. Is that enough? Yeah, make the noise, so I think... Yeah, there we go. We craft a medkit. 
look behind you. But behind me is a window. Okay, so there's somebody just somebody just came up. So I'm just gonna use the med kit now. And they'll probably see the corpses in a minute. Oh yeah, there's definitely there's two people over here. There we go. And then we can kill him. I think the other one is in one of the rooms. So he's not gonna he's not gonna spot me. There was one up here, right? Yeah. There's one up there on the... Is that a balcony or what? Okay, so yeah, he's around the corner. So if I just stay over here, they're gonna have to... Move around. There we go. Don't. You actually can grab them from quite a distance away when you're around the corner like that. And there we go. Throw it on. And she also killed one. Oh, wow. Okay, so there was one in my back, apparently. Um... How quiet. You good? Did we kill everybody? Yeah. Okay. That actually went pretty yeah, smoothly yeah. now. Um, there's another bit of scissors. Yeah, I don't want to get out of here just yet. There's plenty of stuff around here. Okay, since we're full on adhesive... Might as well, there's only one thing I can make with adhesive, which is a better melee weapon. So there we go, crafted that. And then we can grab, yeah, I should probably grab the adhesive then. And then we can grab another bottle, which is basically an instant kill. Bottles are instant kills, that's nice. Oh yeah, that those one hit hatchets are also gone. Kind of forgot about that. That was also something that was in the game. And I haven't seen that anywhere over here. Aha, we find a full-blown med kit over here. That's also really nice. Some more adhesive. I should probably stand up. We know that there's no more enemies. So definitely scrounging the hell out of this office space. So see you guys in a second. This is a big area with lots of things to pick up. So this is really, really good because I got the full health now with a few snack bars, which is really, really nice. And I think that's going to be it. There's something, I don't need to break this, right? Because there's nothing in there. Um, and aside from that, we got a few bullets out of that. We got, uh, upgraded the melee weapon, an extra health kit, which is also really, really nice. I can reload the pistol. Uh, but for now, it seems like we killed everybody. So I'm also gonna check out this, I don't know, flower shop, flower shop, apparently. So this might also contain a few nice goodies. Ooh, shotgun round. That is really, really nice. Why would you keep shotgun rounds in a flower shop? That's a bit weird, but... They were also selling teddy bears, so I don't really care. Um, more bottles. Stuff behind... Is that something behind the window? No, it doesn't seem like it. Because they were selling more than just flowers, which is fine. But the shotgun shell is a bit weird. Probably for protection, I suppose. And again, lots of resources. I think we're going to be uh, full on at least something in a minute and um, then we're gonna have to craft something here Ooh, what's this ah oh, crap okay okay interesting so there are enemies around here Ooh. there we go and there's another runner over there There we go. Stab that one. Gonna be really careful here because I think there's another one behind. This is another big area. What the hell? I thought I'm just gonna gonna crawl underneath here and be fine, but it seems like is that one of those crying ones? Let's just slowly approach it. And there we go. There we go, stab them in the neck. Okay, that's another area cleared of infected and another area we need to uh, scavenge, I think. I just stood up, but I'm supposing, yeah, Dina is also relaxing, so... I love how you get that confirmation through her behavior. Like, if Dina starts to relax and is just walking around, then we should be fine. And we get another trading card over here. Sergeant Frost, trading cards. 
And then, yeah, this seems to be storage for some of the, uh, the shops over here. And we get more alcohol. Alcohol seems to be the thing that I'm lacking the most. And there's a fresh pipe on the floor here, but yeah, my pipe is fully up and reinforced, so can't really do anything with that. I'm even full on health. This is really, really nice. We did find two more pistol bullets, which is also really, really nice. And it seems like we can get out this way. And we get... Through there. Yeah, I, I got that, but there's a lot more buildings over here. So... Because this area spreads out again in, in other directions, because there are buildings around here. But that's the gate we probably bypassed by going over here. Now, we can get on top of the roof of this building. Like this. Okay, so yeah, now we're now we're back to where we were. So that's that's the basketball court again. So yeah, okay, I'm kind of trying to get my bearings to where we are specifically, um, so we can get. Yeah, I think we can just drop down. And we killed everybody over here. This is the back of the flower shop again. Okay, called it. But on the other side of the street, we also have another building we haven't checked out yet, and there's an open truck here. So let's just go meticulously from one side to the next and grab this bit of explosives that should be fine i can probably craft in a second um and this was also a building that the wlf was uh looking around in so i'm guessing there won't be any enemies around here but scrounging period again okay a little bit of supplies but nothing too particular not even a single bullet there were a few more health kits uh well the, the snack bars but uh, since I'm full up on health, that doesn't really matter. I think the only thing I haven't really checked out is this little cabinet. But there doesn't seem to be anything here. So let's just... Is this a separate area? No, it just gets me on top of this building again. And that is exactly where we need to go through to actually go further. So we're back where we uh, ended the fight last time. So I'm just going to quickly check over here. Nothing here. So now we can move on through what's supposedly the critical path. Um, this also seems like it's, uh, every time there's like chest high walls or groin high walls, I should say, in okay. this game, I feel like we're going to have to fight. Now what? Okay, I thought Ellie was going to re respond with at least something, but we don't get a prompt either to start talking about it. So let's just move on. And climb up and over with some assistance from hey, Dina. Dina. Yeah. So up and over. Uh, will you be able to get? Oh yeah, she's probably gonna help us get over it as well. So uh, give me your hand. Giving us a hand. Uh, can we just can we just jump? Or is there is there a prompt? Ah, oh, there we go. Just just needed to jump. No prompt necessary. Hey, that round building. The TV station. It looks like the TV station from your map. Yeah. Come on. Okay, so that's where we need to go. We're heading in the right direction, at least. I don't know how I would have done all this without you. Look at you. Shut up. I never would have let you do this by yourself. I'm glad I'm here, too. Yeah, because I mean... Oh, shit. Oh, crap. <laughs> What the fuck was that? I ran into a trap. A what? Explosive traps. Watch where you're walking. <laughs> okay. Well, that changes the the gameplay a little bit. Watch where you're walking. Oh crap! There's more of them. Ah, there's trip wires. I mean, he can run into that, right? If he just runs into that, that's not going to be a problem, is it? He can see me. Come on, see me. Unless there's something on the left, but... Is there something on the left? Doesn't seem like it. Hey, dumbass! You're not even looking in my direction. That is interesting. So there probably was a trip I tied to... Okay. So this is hard difficulty, by the way. I'm just going to... 
look around in this direction. There's more bullets over here. Are there enemies in this building? So that... That clicker came out in style, by the way. <laughs> he just ran out. Seems like we can just go around this area again. So more resources for us, I suppose. I'm gonna check behind the counter, but we need to be careful that there aren't any... who are making a lot of noise. So there's rags over here and shotgun ammo. Shotgun ammo. So I should probably just reload everything while we're at it. Um, because the shot... Where's the shotgun? Oh, the shotgun is over here. So let's just go over here. And then we can reload this bad boy. Up to three rounds. That's good. Then uh, I'm just going to swap to the pistol again. And we're going to craft... I think we're going to craft another Molotov. I have another health kit, so that is fine. So let's do that. Offense instead of defense. And back to the pistol. Maybe even the uh, the bottle. I'm making a lot of noise, aren't I? <laughs> just running through. Oh, and there's another trading card over here. And more alcohol over here. And that seems to be it, I think. Yeah, let's just, let's just go down. Ooh, and there's more tripwires over here on the sides. But, hello. Hey, hey, runners. Yeah, there we go. And then this one over here on the right. No, no, let him come. Let him come. Let him come. Stop. That was stupid, Dina. We just had to let him come. Okay. Yeah, so we got over that because they triggered this bomb. Um, just remember that we can use bombs against our enemies. The tripwires will help us out. I do love that Dina probably has infinite ammo. So I should just let her do the fighting most of the time. There we go. And then, is there something over here? Doesn't seem like it. No, there were just... It's just a little area they were wandering around in. Okay. Moving down. Moving down. Into this broken down area. Yeah, we're gonna have to. Oh, we can slide, probably. That's gonna be funny. Oh, one, a two, a three. Uncharted sliding. Fuck. I'm okay. Come on. I don't think there's enemies around just yet. You gotta be careful, though. Because I'm always crouching, even though there's no enemies around just yet. And I would think the water kind of disturbs the... The sound that you would be made. What if you're gone by the time we get there? I don't want to think about that right now. Um, yeah, because that doesn't really matter at this point as well. If she's gone, then we're going to just. Some of those trip wires up around Jackson. Might be a good way to deal with the hordes. Yeah, that'd be smart. I don't know, because they Probably only take out one. Some stragglers. They put up signs, warning them. What if they can't read? We'll make drawings. You know, like a foot tripping over a wire and then big... That I sounds like a plan. I like you. I want it in writing. <laughs> okay. I met this um, guy once, friend of Joel's. Trip wired a whole town. How'd people get around? It was just him. Wait, he lived alone in the entire town? Yeah, his name was Bill. Good trust issues. That's sad. Kept him alive. It's not like you have to choose between being alive and being close to people. It's not black and white. You take a risk, though. Hey, look. I'm looking. Who do you think it is? Uh, someone who wants us to feel her love. Feel her Maybe love. She's related to the wolves. I don't know. It's kind of fucking weird. Okay, so there's... There's this wall. I should probably... Uh, can I add a note to my journal about this? It's usually something... Ooh, she has a nasty scar on her face as well. Um, but... We can probably go around here. 
cool, but there is a corpse. Is that a horse? And a clicker? And a dead guy. Is the clicker dead? Are are both of the clickers Holy dead? Shit. These were all shot. Huh. Uh, maybe there's a sniper guy then. So a clicker, another clicker, another oh and that's a runner, and that's a horse. Hey, look. It's Tommy's. Okay. Ugh. Ah, because it's Except marked it by the J of well. Jackson. Is there anything in there? No? No not a clue? <coughs> Seriously? You okay? Yeah, sorry. It's just a smell. Ugh. All right. I must have taken off on foot. You good to keep going? Yeah, I'm fine. Please. Wha Whoa, wait, wait, wait. How many people have we killed? How many infected have we killed? This, is, this shouldn't trigger you more than anything else we've seen. Um, unless, of course, she's... You know, pregnant. That could also be the case. Um, there's also something over here. It's another bottle canister. So I can definitely make more bombs. Um, so let's go. Now we should be working so up. Wrecked? Boston wasn't like this, was it? Boston didn't have a full blown civil war. Fireflies never put up this kind of resistance. But, yeah, I, I don't think even a full-blown civil war TV would station? break down the road like that. Yeah, it's that way. Yeah, we can still see the Uphill. TV station. Calm down. There we go, we can grow... Ooh. Okay. More bodies. More shot bodies. Yep. Tommy definitely came this way. I bet he went through there. To where exactly? Just looking around if I can find anything else in this tall grass. Might be overdoing this a little bit, but you know me. I'm uh, nothing if not meticulous. And then there's a... Ooh. So he did block that off with a crowbar. A solid barricade. I mean... Okay, well, not going this way. Not really. If you put your fingers in between there, you can slowly pull out the crowbar, I suppose. Although the mattress might be a little bit more difficult. So we're not going that way and that probably gives the game a little... Ooh, there's a tripwire on the right. Stop. Yeah, there's more tripwire. Tri and we actually... Oh, shit. Good catch. Uh, D-not! D-not! Not good catch! Just standing right All in front over. of it. Probably for infected. So that's... Still... One wrong step. Those yeah. are claymores. Let's be careful. Those are freaking claymores. Um, okay, so I'm gonna have to break this window. I am on edge. This is not fun. I mean, not fun because we're gonna be eaten by infected. Not fun or blown to pieces because Tommy was a bit creative with his claymores. Okay, any enemies? Not just yet, so this seems to be a dojo of some kind. Whew, I'm a little bit on edge. Um, there's, there's a bit of rags in there, but I might as well grab them. Um, but other than that, I don't see any tripwires just yet. So I might as well just look around a little bit. There is a back area here. Hello? Oh, there's a note on the wall. Rebecca. So that's between Rebecca and Fran. We've heard those names before. By now you've realized I didn't get on the bus. I love you, but I don't understand how you can stand by these fucking fascists. They killed one of my neighbors, dragged him on his knees and shot him in front of his own home. His name was Jimmy. I've known him since he was 13 when I caught him swiping a magazine from my shop. I was the first person he came out to. He said this weird prayer before he died. I keep replaying it in my mind. May the current be calm, may she guide me home. I'm gonna head up to the cabin, figure out what to do next. I hope you'll come to, to your senses and meet me there, Fran. So yeah, we're getting a little 
a little bit of a story between these two characters. Where one joined the uh, Washington Liberation Front and the other one didn't. That of course caused, caused... That of course caused trouble. Damn, that was for some reason really hard to say. Um, anything else around here? No, some alcohol. And other than that... Ooh, another workbench. Another workbench. But I don't really... I don't think I have enough... I think I only picked up one batch of parts in between this and the previous one. Yeah, we got 38, so that's not gonna... I only have that uh, fire rate upgrade for the uh, revolver left. Um, so let's just grab the bottle. Oh, bottles are nice. So there's definitely more... Yeah. Probably don't cut through here much with all this. There's that silver lining. Yeah, I mean, we can use it against enemies. If there are any enemies. Doesn't seem like they are enemies, but anyway, I'm just gonna be really, really careful. It's if I... tall grass is making me nervous. Yeah, they're getting tricky to see. They, they are. I'm, I'm still gonna blow myself up. This is gonna be, this is gonna be really painful to watch, seeing Ali torn to pieces. But there is another area over here, so we can run around. A furniture shop. Are there enemies in here? Doesn't seem like it. There doesn't seem to be any tripwires anywhere over here either. Ah, we get another trading card. The Bizarrebra trading card. Okay then. Just gonna turn the flashlight on. Okay. Let's open up a door, get two more doors. Anything on the... Yeah, there's another letter over here. Make sure you take the envelope to the bank before Monday. Made the combo the last six digits to Stacy's phone number. Figured that'd be easy for you to remember. And then the phone number, but the last part is... Erased. So that is going to be interesting. Stacy's phone number put away. So Stacy's phone number might be on here somewhere. Oh yeah. It's probably that. So 550123. Oh god. Oh Jesus Christ. Um can, can we? No, 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 no. Oh, oh god. What the fuck is this? I think it just died on its okay? own. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, that was horrifying. Thank you for that. I I think I still remember the 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 combination. Holy shit, my heart. Whoo, but five five zero one two three. There we go. Oh no. Guess not. Wait, wait a second. It I mean, that's the phone number, right? The last six digits of the phone number. Okay, so if that no it is not Stacy's number, how are we gonna find Stacy's num? Oh wait, there it is. Aha! Call Stacy, and it's five five for a good time. Call Stacy. Okay, five five zero one three three. That's it. It's not. It's not the the one two three. It's not one two three. It's more difficult than that. Okay, that were pills. There we go. That opened up the safe. And we got... Ooh. Bullets. Bullets and scissors and stuff like that. That was really, really nice. Some more bullets. Okay, so that's a canister. And we can make bombs with canisters. So... I think... Or, you know, the silencer thing. Silences the pistol, breaks after three shots. Might as well try that. There we go. And then we have, yeah, two more for the... Yeah, we can make another bomb. There we go. Because we're almost onto a second batch of explosives as well. We can grab this. Swap to the now silenced pistol. So that's going to break after two you. Oh, and there's more adhesive over here. But yeah, I can't make anything else with adhesive. We haven't really had to use our melee weapon. Lately, I've been really pretty stealthily. And uh, pretty conservative with my ammo and such. So that is absolutely fine. So moving on, 
So they were mentioning like, you know, tripwires being hard to see. There's one over there. Do, can we actually go through here? Because it looks like we should be able to get through here, right? Unless we can go through that shop over there, but I'm still going to blow myself up in a second. I'm just going to warn you right now. That is going to happen. Wait, so I think I can get on top of the truck here. And then... Oh, that is not a good idea, is it? But I think it is going to be the only way to go. Yeah, it's going to be... The only way... No, 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 what are you doing? She automatically veered to the left. Was that for fucking effect? That was horrifying. Okay, so we get another... Okay, Seriously, I just jumped straight. More of this stuff. Huh. So I think they saw that we could do that and they just... Oh, that was... That was gross, come on. I just jumped, jumped perfectly straight. I didn't even touch the uh, the stick there. I just went straight and then they just feared me off to the left to blow Ellie up. That was not good. Um, is this something we can... Have we checked this out before? Anyway, Ellie. Are you fucking kidding me? Seriously, I jumped into the wall and she just moved straight into another bomb. Um, yeah, resetting this. Okay, that kind of ticked me oh, off twice stuff. there. Huh. So there's clearly... I mean... That is clearly a window you should be able to climb into, right? Or is this... Ah! Man, I couldn't see that for shit. Um, and this is the workbench again. Okay, fair enough. So we could have just quickly gone through here. So let's open that up again. That's probably the way forward. That was really annoying it was really not clear that that was a window not to me anyway um then this place okay we got a few more rags we know there's a bomb to the left here so might as well go out on the right and carefully move around so yeah i blew myself up a few times now there's definitely one hiding in the brush there so we took the right <laughs> Nope, I saw that. Saw that just in time. Oh, this is going to be perfect, isn't it? Um, so there's one right in front of us. So we can move to the side here. Imagine having to fight in this place. What's that? There's something in the corner here. Okay, a bunch of bottles. There's a TV station. Yeah, yeah, I know. But how the hell do we get... Oh, I get it. I, I got the hint. I don't think we can get around this one. There we go. Smart. That works. Yes, it yeah. does. I've seen Joel do this. Uh, you think someone heard that? Probably. It was pretty loud. Keep your eyes peeled. Um... Well, we blew up a few times already, so that's not that much of a problem. Okay, so let's go to the side here. That gives me another ambush bolt if I need it. Um, and the brick is going to stay handy. Because I can use it to kill stuff with it. Okay, I, thought, I saw a staircase and I just assumed that we could use, you know, the staircase like a normal person. Ooh! Shit. Zuba. Stay down there. These stairs are wired up. Can you detonate them? Not here. Um. Can, can I... Can I climb up? No, I can't. Can I climb back down? How the hell am I gonna do that? Um, so I could go over here. And then that made them from a distance, I suppose. Yeah, there's another bottle over here, so... Um, oh, for fuck's sake. I'm just gonna hit the pole, because... Or maybe even the claymore itself. Okay, so that triggered both They're of them. not being subtle right now. No, definitely not. Maybe Leah will come to us. Yeah. Or they might be waiting to ambush us. 
Yeah, I'm really, I'm really not happy with how things are going now. This is gonna be bad. Uh, need to get in there. Okay, but we can just jump over, right? Over over here, over over there, and over over here. There we go. Straight to another ball. Let's just always stay sneaky. This is gonna be really good for Ellie's squads. She's gonna feel the burn. Okay, so. There it is. That's a TV station. Stay low. We are where we need to be. Okay. Um. This is a wide open area, by the way. It feels empty. Yeah. I it don't does. Buy it. You see a way in? Not yet. This is very wide open. This does not make any sense at all. Not in the current situation. Maybe we can go in through the garage? There's more, ooh, more explosive stuff over here. Truck isn't open, I just wanted to check that. But this TV station truck is open. What is that on top of it? Because it looks like a futuristic cannon, cannon of some sort, but probably isn't. There's a way up there if I wanted to. But this is definitely blocked off, so that's not the way. But if we go... Can I climb over here? This seems like a... A path to climb. Although, no. Doesn't... Doesn't really seem... I probably won't be able to make that, right? No. Okay, I don't. I'm not Nathan Drake. I'm Ellie. Well, maybe over here? This is a weird building, by the way. With those elevated garden thingies. Maybe to the right here. That seems to be doable though. So let's just go up here. Then to the right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This, this seems to be the right way. And then up here. And then up here. Okay. That guy. So Tommy must have reached this as well. Oh, fuck. Because he eviscerated this guy. Tommy do this? Yeah, probably. Let's get inside. Let's not ask answers to ask questions you don't want the answer to. Tommy got a bow. I want that as well. I really want a bow. Okay, so there's a rope hanging just out there. I'm just wondering if there's anything. Oh, there's again those ammo casings. I hate those things. <laughs> That's just laughing in my face. Look, we have a dire box full of ammo, but you can't have any. Uh-uh-uh. Okay. So it, is, it does give us a weird dynamic, the fact that Tommy is ahead of us constantly, because every time we enter a new area, everybody's already dead. Um, let's just be ex extremely not subtle and grab that, because that gives us... Alcohol is always very nice. Alcohol gives us a health kit, so... Alcohol is definitely a priority. Fuck. You heard it here first. Be careful. People, alcohol is vital to your survival. But, uh, we could use the axe, but the axe is... I mean, it has an extra charge, but we're doing fine, aren't we? This is gonna break when we pass. Or not. I should definitely stop the episode here, but I'm not going to. I'm not going to. This is just too tense to stop now. Hello? Now that seems to be locked off. Okay. So that means that we only have a single door for us. <laughs> it's gotta be this one. There we go. And this seems to be just a supply closet with lots more alcohol. Just grab all of that. Um, is there anything behind the shell? The door? No. I am gonna maybe upgrade again. So we're at... 76, but we were going into the stealth, um, yeah, the stealth tree here, so that's 50 pills for 50% more movement speed while crouched. Ooh, I don't really notice that, but apparently what? it's 50% more fast. What about that? What about what? Is there a way up here maybe I just missed? I don't... Oh, yeah, that, that could... Oh, no. Oh, no, yeah, I'm just, I'm pushing forward. Oh, no. Ooh, gold. Okay, that's a sight. Did Tommy do all of this on his own? Sounds kind of ridiculous. Holy. Is 
This is definitely not Tommy. No. Who the fuck did this? I don't know. But it's a message. Yeah, it definitely is. There's definitely more than what I'm gonna turn on. Yeah, they might be to so will you not please move forward on your own? God damn, look at that. Um Well, I thought there was gonna be Ooh, they were even gutted. Yeah, their guts are hanging out. This is some Hannibal Lecter shit. <laughs> okay, um, I'm going to take a little break because I thought there was going to be another set piece. It's, well, this kind of counts as a set piece, but I'm going to take a little break. So thank you guys enormously for watching. Hope you guys um, in enjoyed this episode of The Last of Us Part 2. And when we get back, we're going to continue exploring the TV station and hopefully not get disemboweled ourselves. So uh, thank you enormously for watching. See you guys next time. Goodbye.